our channel. The weather has uh, turned rainy here in SoCal. So it is perfect for a bowl of congee. So today we're having pork congee with century year old, 100 year old egg. These black intimidating eggs um, with very pungent taste. Um, it's dripping, but closer look, I guess. You guys know these eggs. You know the eggs that you look so gross that you don't want to try? <laughs> but yeah, it's this. It's so good. And mom made it. It's homemade. Oh, and we have pork's blood because, you know, we love pork's blood here. <laughs> and yeah, so, yeah, mom, it's homemade. Mom made it. Oh, and here, guys, this is the Chinese, it's in, in Vietnamese, it's called Yao Yao Wai. Don't ask me how to spell it. <laughs> but in, we Googled it, I Googled it, and it's um, Chinese twist, no, chi Chinese donuts for kanji. So yeah, it's really good. You know what you want to say? Chào lấy xương, xương nấu xong rồi cái tấm, tấm rồi cái do, do xong rồi cái gan, gan lên chút cho nó thơm đó. Bắt lên cái nồi nước cho nó sôi rồi bỏ cháo vô để lửa hiu hiu hiu, cháo nó nở ra, nở ra, từ từ từ, nó ra cái nhựa á, ừ. lửa, lửa lửa hiu 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 rồi mình thấy cháo nó ra nhựa rồi cái đâu, rồi mình our Vietnamese viewers are in a treat because you guys would have understand everything she said because our American viewer, viewers and like English speaking viewers, sorry, don't know how to translate that. <laughs> but anyway, my mom is actually eating it a lot more flavorful than I am just because mine is just the plain basic as it is. Hers, she put um, bean sprout. Um, she put ginger, she put extra ginger, and then she put, um, what else did she put? She put, like, chili in this, this chili. Yeah, so she has a lot of different, and then she, um, squeezed lime in it as well. Mine is just pure, all natural, original. <laughs> it doesn't get any better than the original taste. And then here, she also put like, she she went, she feeds me good because look at this. <laughs> look at this pork bone. Saving the best for last, so I'm saving that for later. I don't know how you guys like to eat it with this, but I like to dunk it and emerge it and let it soak. Mom, just right now, she just ate it like, Dipping. Without dipping, but you can eat that too. Whatever you guys like, you know, pork's blood is scary. Got to make sure it's really cooked all the way. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Again, oh, if you guys made it this far in the video, thanks. And if you like this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Have I shared you guys with this? Have you guys? Have I shared the story of when my mom didn't cook pork's blood all the way? Oh, my sister's saying yes. It's really traumatizing when you eat it raw. Trust. You don't want to eat that raw. Like many things. <laughs> oh, and then she also um have dry shrimp. No, you guys can see that. Thumb coal. Thumb coal. Long. It didn't take her that long to make it either. It's only like what max forty minutes, an hour. Yeah, it's so flavorful, so good. Now when I don't allow don't have to. Mm. 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 Mm.
cỡ hộp tắm nó thơm á Mm. This is like legit home food, like comfort food right here. Nam ta ăn là có da heo, ớt chanh ngò, nhiều. Mmm, I love eating this Chinese donut soaked in so it's like soft and it's not hard and guys we bought this fresh like they made it fresh it was so fragrant when we got brought it home yeah thousand year old egg isn't in a lot of stuff besides like gal and Mom, right? Mom, chung. Thịt chung. And what else is it in? But yeah, it's not. I don't remember eating it with a lot of other stuff besides chow. This chow hail. Describe the taste. Huh? It's very, um, so the taste is like, it's not. It is kind of strong. Like the aftertaste is kind of strong. The yolk part, like the the yolk part but it's not something that it's not bad at all it is intimidating for sure um it's different have you guys actually tried 100 year old eggs and if so is it was it in kanji let us know we would love to know all about it yeah guys so like i said in the beginning of the video it's just this is probably like the first day it started raining in november and what a day because it is cold it is windy and luckily mom had ingredients to make this and it's just the perfect um it's like the perfect wet like food to eat in this weather in addition to pho. <laughs> it's one of those dishes where it's best to eat it in this type of weather. Mom makes me laugh. Just so damn cute. Dude. Do you get like the bone marrow? Do you guys suck on it too? Cause like, you know? Cause it's good. Or is that weird? I'm not honest guys. Wait. I don't know if, I, if you guys can like really see it, but you see the bone marrow, all that good gunk in there. That's, this is the reason why the broth is so sweet and flavorful. So good. Mmm. So, that's really good. I'm so glad I didn't get like a, you know, I didn't choke on that. <laughs> on camera <laughs> so good oh let me put this away I'm about done have it guys we're done for this mukbang um it's clean um let us know if you guys have tried century year old egg or pork's blood <laughs> we love those 
special ingredients here. Um, let us know if you guys actually tried pork congee before or even tried to attempt making it. Um, if, if you guys like this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye. Stay warm and safe.